The Coastal Bend Sports Authority, Alan Harwell, with your Chris 6 Sports Report. Hi, good evening, everybody. We're live at Dell Diamond in Round Rock. The Class 5A state tournament is underway. In fact, we just had the first semifinal game played. Eaton defeated Humble Kingwood 3-2 to two in extra innings. So that's the team that hopefully Veterans Memorial will be playing on Saturday at high noon. We're joined now by Kimberly James, the principal at Veterans Memorial. Wow, year three, and you guys have been going all over the place at all sports, and now you're in the semifinals of baseball. Give me a chance to brag a little bit here. Pretty exciting, Alan. Our kids are great. Um, in fact, when I got here to Austin, I'm staying at the hotel where my athletes are, and uh, they were waiting in the lobby fixing to go to batting practice, and I asked them, I said, are y'all ready? Are you excited? How do you feel? And they said, it's just another game, Miss James. It's not just another game. You know, as I look down on the crowd, boy, you're going to have a big crowd tonight. You have a lot of support. How is this a little early for all this to be happening? Are we did, did you expect it this early? No, I really didn't expect it at all. However, when I think back to the type of coaches that we've hired and the type of kids and the parent support, I, you really can um, I, we have to be there. We have to be here in, the, in these kind of competitions. These appearances aren't just happening on accident. It's ironic you only have five seniors right. on the baseball team, so yeah. Job security for Coach Gager, right? I mean, he's got a lot of young kids. Yes, that's for sure. Five seniors. That was pretty exciting on graduation day to have to get those guys out um, and to give them their diplomas first so that they could make it back to the, you know, the playoff game. So it's been real exciting for them and great leadership, really yes. good leadership of those. W without a doubt. Kimberly, good to see you. Thank you so much. Hope you come out with a victory tonight. If not, and if you do, we'll be back here on Saturday. Awesome. All right, we'll be back at 10 o'clock for live updates on the big game. We'll see you then.